than 100 people die every single day in the U.S. from firearms. This is according to new CDC data. And after hearing all this, this is why we wanted to bring in WREL investigative data journalist Ali Ingersoll. Ali, you've been looking at how serious of a problem this is here locally. Yeah, Chris and Lena, we've been reporting on an increase in shootings in our area, and new research shows that firearm fatalities have now reached a 28-year high. We know now more than 1,800 people in North Carolina died from gun violence in 2021. This is all according to the CDC. About half of them were self-inflicted, according to the data. Firearm deaths have trended upward as gun sales, too, they increased nationwide. According to researchers, more than 7 million people across the country became gun owners for the very first time during the pandemic. Men are more likely to be victims of gun violence, that CDC data shows, making up 85 percent of those who died from firearm incidents. The majority of people who were killed by firearms in North Carolina, they were white and they weren't Hispanic. When we look at rates per population, though, people who are black or American Indian or Native Alaskan, they were affected more with 30 and almost 25 deaths per capita. Now, there wasn't enough reliable data for a background uh, for a breakdown of other backgrounds. Research published in November notes that any sort of public health response to firearm violence should consider these differences when addressing the underlying cause of what is driving up gun deaths.